Hello, Gemini, and welcome to your coffee cup reading for the week of June 1st through June 7th. It's already June. It's my birthday month, the end of June, though. So happy June, and um, halfway through the year already. Wow. This is a very general reading, so let's see what shows up. Okay. Wow, this is a strong energy. This is something maybe that you're um, holding on to past hurts. Uh, this is two's company, three's a crowd. People may be telling you what to do, how to do it, meddling in your business, and that's something that you need to let go of. Now, for others, this could be um, maybe it was with work. It could be that you there was a maybe a good business deal that came through too, or something with um, no, okay, something may have occurred with work that could have been someone meddling there, unwanted advice, unwanted opinions. Now, this could have been you had an affair or with someone at work or something like that. Be careful of that energy too. So I do see that. That is for someone out there. Now, there's a, like a good business deal coming through. You are quite driven. Okay. You are driven. Something is so dried up here that's telling me you need to let go of something. This is in the past. This could be an ex coming back or thoughts of it. And then it's like they offer you something. I don't look at it as good. Um, cause they do may have someone else or something cause I see a third party involved. So it's up to you. I can't tell you what to do. It's your heart. It's your life, but it's showing up like that. You're very driven this, uh, this week. It's your, there's, um, your, this is a very high, high, um, energy around too. Okay. There is luck on your side though. All right, let's see. Ooh, let's see, let's see, let's see. Okay, happy energy. You really start off with a pretty good energy here. This is a yes answer to anything maybe I don't answer. I do see happy energy. This is uh, having fun, um, enjoying your time. This could be also some of you dealing with a Pisces type of energy that could be surrounding you. So it looks pretty good. This could be a yes answer or just really happy energy. Um it can be like wish and desires. Don't overdo anything. That's one thing I do see here too. I do see also there's a lot of like daydreaming, okay? Wanting to manifest, thinking of the future. There's like, there's fire in your belly. But um, this is like kind of faded energy, new beginnings, adventurous type of energy. It's like you have, um, some of you may want to take some risks, okay? So sometimes you have to take a leap of faith, a faith, a faith faith too, to be able to manifest some of your daydreams because everything is possible. Um, I do see very strong energy coming through, um, more clarity, trust your intuition. You may be getting advice. This is someone supportive. I also see like a cancer energy surrounding you. Okay. So you may be dealing with a cancer, that kind of energy where it's very supporting, loving, um, intuition as well. Uh, you may be feeling stuck. Um, it's like telling you, hold your horses, think things through. So it's like kind of stuck in some situation, but a lot of ideas are coming through. I do see that energy too. So there is something that you have to, there's a reason why there is a delay and you have to think something through. There is a new beginning that is opening up in a new path. Okay. So that's why maybe that's why it's showing up like that. You have a lot of competitive energy here. Okay lot. Some of you may be dealing with some competition. Uh, maybe this is you're been applying for a job or a position or something and or a team or sports and you're waiting to be like called or selected um, or you're waiting to for a contract um, or to get a position, something like that is showing up. There's a learning experience here too. Okay. So there are some changes here. Um, don't bite off more than you can chew though too. This can be also indicate a lot of multitasking. Change, change, change is coming through too. One thought at a time. Write your thoughts down. You may be forgetting them because there's a lot running, racing through your mind too for a lot of you. There is a spade going up. So this could be landing um, some kind of contract, agreement, signing some kind of legal document or agreement that is showing up as well. Could be even court. But there is something there. And this is good advice here. There's someone very supportive, um, wisdom, intuition. I like this energy as well. So very nice um energy. This could be um, also with love, very understanding energy. For some of you, this is a mentor coming through. Um, words of wisdom are coming through here too and growth. And I see a new financial beginning. So there is something that is coming through as well. Maybe this is a gift. Maybe someone gifts you something this week as well. I do see you will be closing up some kind of emotional 
um, baggage or something because you are going to be moving forward. You have that drive to move forward. You're leaving something that upsets you behind. So it's like closing up in a new chapter. For others, um, no, for, for some of you too, I do see like a Libra energy. So you have um, a Libra type of energy too that surrounds you. Um, this also can indicate another air. There's air sign um, type of energy around too. This could be another Gemini. This could be um, Aquarius too, Libra. But there's a sense of needing a balance too. It could be just the energies that um, and the temperament that's around you this week as well. So you have quite a bit uh, going on. You have the strength. Um, it's like some of you are going to take on some kind of a challenge. Maybe someone's going to try to, you know, someone wants to call, you, you may call someone's bluff and you take on someone's challenge. You are ready to take on that challenge. So you're going to fight for what you want or what you need. Uh, that's one thing I'm seeing. For others, this is like finishing up to practice for a test or finishing up. This could be school. You're finishing your exams to graduate to something like that. I am seeing that kind of energy as well. And I do see a um, good new path. So there are new beginnings coming through here as well. Very high driven, high energy. But, you know, don't bite off more than you can chew, though. There's so much going on at the same time as well. Okay. So quite interesting. I think you're surrounded by a lot of type of di different types of energies. I see like uh, water signs, um, air signs, basically, is what mostly is showing up here as well. Um, people are going to see how strong you are. Okay. So you are a force to be reckoned with too. So I do see that energy coming through too. So interesting. And it's, it's a general reading. Now, what I want to say with Gemini, um, this week is June 1st, this reading for June 1st to the 7th for everyone who has a birthday that this week, I wish you a very happy birthday and a very Blessed solar year ahead. Also, I know a lot of you have ordered your um, birthday readings. Now, anyone now that orders, I can, can't promise it will come by your birthday. I have too many. Um, and I'm going to be going on vacation at the end of July, approximately. I will give those dates out. So even for other signs that are coming up, they're going to have to place them earlier. <laughs> Overbooked with those. So... I just wanted to let you know about that. But I will, you know, if you do want one, that's fine. I just can't promise the dates because um, I've got so many of them. So you can check with check in with me. Check out Instagram. I do post daily readings there and also uh, weekend specials for Gemini. I'm trying to do even more there. I just need more time. Um, and the link to my Instagram and my website is below this video. And yeah, I do wish, again, happy birthday to all of you. And to, that celebrate this week. And for everyone else, have a wonderful week. And catch you back next week for your next Coffee Cup reading. Until then, all the best. Bye for now.